With Vice President Kamala Harris, now the likely Democratic nominee for the presidential race, several traditional news outlets are backtracking previous reports and scrubbing information they once reported about VP Harris. The biggest scrubbing attempt we found was the title of Border Czar, given to Harris by Republicans and the media quickly after President Biden's announcement. In March of 2021, roughly two months after President Biden was sworn into office, he appointed Harris to work with Mexican and Central American leaders to help find the root causes of migration from Central America to the United States. I've asked her, uh, the VP today, because she's the most qualified person to do it, to lead our efforts with uh, Mexico and the Northern Triangle and the countries uh, that uh, help uh, we're going to need help in stemming the movement of uh, so many folks uh, stemming the migration to our southern border. The White House never gave Harris the official title of border czar. However, several news outlets did, including CNN, ABC News, and CBS News. MRC Newsbusters on X posted this video showing the media calling Harris the border czar before Biden dropped out of the race to this week saying that was never true. And this will be her first visit to the uh, U.S.-Mexico border region since she was appointed as the border czar by President Biden. People gonna have to counter the misinformation. You already hear folks talking about the border czar. She wasn't the border czar. President Biden tapped Kamala Harris, Vice President Kamala Harris, to be the border czar. Now she wasn't the border czar. That's what Republicans uh, labeled her. So, as you can see, various news outlets called Harris the border czar in their initial reporting. But here's the deal. While neither President Biden nor the White House ever gave Harris that title, the term czar is an informal moniker granted to officials tasked with overseeing broad aspects of an issue. Now, there are even reports from those same media outlets from early to mid 2021, stating that Harris's team didn't want President Biden's tasking of Harris with root causes of migration to be mislabeled as the person in charge of securing the U.S. southern border or border policy. Here's one example. There's this story from CNN from June 1st, 2021, which in part reads, quote, Vice President Kamala Harris and her staff have sought to make one thing clear. She does not manage the southern border. And then here's another example. This headline from The Washington Post from April 16th, 2021, that reads, Republicans try to crown Harris the border czar. She rejects the title. Even Axios reported in 2021 that Harris was appointed by Biden as border czar, a report the media outlet had to walk back and make a correction to this Wednesday. Axios now says VP Harris never actually had the title of border czar and that this article has been updated and clarified to note that Axios was among the news outlets that incorrectly labeled Harris a border czar back in 2021. So to be clear in the facts, Vice President Harris was never the border czar and was never tasked with fixing the U.S. southern border. It was indeed congressional Republicans and the media who gave Harris the border czar title. And now the media is attempting to rewrite its own reporting. Harris has been in charge of finding root causes of migration from Central America to the U.S. For Straight Arrow News, I'm Lauren Taylor. For more unbiased straight facts, download the Straight Arrow News app.